hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of No Man's Sky. Alrighty, when we left off, we had just gotten done collecting all the gamma wheat we needed to continue that particular mission, and now, all we have to do, really, is go back to our previous system. That might be a trick, though. <laughs> I don't remember which one had my missions. So, here's what we're going to do. We're going to go to the log <laughs> and make sure that it's focused on that. There we go. I should be able to fly back then to them. Right? <laughs> should be able to... It doesn't give me the mission. <laughs> uh, I don't know which system it is. Uh, go there, because maybe it's there. Because <laughs> at the very least, I can deal with the settlement. If it's not here. Maricumo system. Yeah, no, that wasn't the system. That wasn't the system at all. Yeah. Bugger. Okay. So which system is where my ship is? Yeah, my capital ship is in the his the Nohistasek system. trick will be scrap I, I don't need to visit the scrap dealer right now calm down and histosec it doesn't tell me that ah. maybe it doesn't tell me at all Boy. Hmm. This is annoying. This is very annoying. <laughs> Doesn't tell me stuff like that. Planet to one moon. It doesn't tell me anything I can identify anything by. Oi! <laughs> I'm losing my mind. Oh boy, I'm going to be losing my mind trying to figure this out. I think I caught it. I think I caught it as I traveled out. I noticed that it said how many planets and moons there were. Uh, discovered by Sembo. But I don't think discovered by me. Or at least not that closely. Okay. Yeah, I know previous system, yeah. Five planets, one moon? No, it was four planets, one moon. Four planets, two moons. What? What? <laughs> I know I visited that station. Are you now telling me I didn't? I guess you are. Okay. New plan. 
new plan of attack. I will go to the galaxy map and find where my ship went. Uh, this, I thought, used to be easier. Okay. Okay. Alrighty. Where is my capital ship? I have no idea. <laughs> I have literally no idea. Huh. Station. I guess we go there. Why not? Hmm. Okay. That's an ominous looking thing. There, now it fits the shape properly. <laughs> Presumably, this was where I was at before. Interesting. But I know these give me words. I gotta run around and get those. Thank you for proving me right. I was about to look like a crazy person because I passed over three. Okay. Ooh. Okay, up we go. There we go. So far, I've only gotten one word. It's a little distressing. There. For you. Hmm. Wow. None of the other ones gave any words except for you and the other one, which I didn't pay attention to. <laughs> Alright. Look at these lovely little things here. Oh. Warp cells. You muelu the infinite. Yape the ufor ro robot. Hate duk plen. Okay. Ufor ku traveler. The Atlas called me to this interface, and yet its purpose remains unclear. It demands worship. It demands obedience. It welcomes me. It knows what I am. It offers the gift of true 
understanding. But why? Why does such power and knowledge crave submission? It knows my thoughts before I know them myself. It knows what I will do. The Atlas asks me to follow its path. I will accept this. The sky is deep and full of wonders, and the path to enlightenment opens to me. Okay. Atlas seed containing zonally shifted quasi-stellular substrate. Stellar substrate. Plus not. Warning, do not allow Matrix to commune with this dimensional space. Huh? Well, it's something I can make at least. And I guess if I can't find where I left my freighter... I guess I gotta have the freighter come back to me. Cool. I just noticed we dropped a number of frames. I apologize. <laughs> I don't know when that happened or why. Actually, now I think I do know why. So give me a moment. Whoa. Yes, I'm at the bottom of all visited systems now. Okay, give me a moment. I'll fix this. Be right back. All right, and we're back. And, uh, not quite sure what happened there. Um, apparently OBS was, uh, not properly running. So, uh, I reset it. Here's hoping it actually works from here on out. And I'm gonna check on these freighters here. I'm curious if they're actually better than my current one or not. They do look different. But are they better? That's the question I try to answer. at where the ships land, because I know they're coming in. If I landed over there, someone's going to land here soon, I'm sure. Or something. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe I was wrong. Anyway. I'm going to see what this freighter may be worth. Just to satiate my curiosity. Offer to buy. Doesn't look all that different from mine. In fact, it's worse than mine. Interesting. <laughs> yeah, no. Although it would be nice to have a Gek crew. <laughs> but no. No. Looks like not this time. Besides, I didn't have the money anyway, so. A 
All right. Get out of here. And technically, because the Atlas stations are found by someone else first, usually, in my experience so far, the planets sometimes are or not. Looks like that's true of this Xeno colony here. And, uh, what was it? Was it the, uh... Was it this one here? Yeah. Ormsock Prime. Hmm. So I could claim one of these. Or something like that as well. Which would probably be a good idea. There we go. Now I continue my base missions, among other things. Because, you know, I have a lot of them. Talk to the farmer. Pretty sure the gamma reed... The gamma... Reed? Gamma wheat. I'm, I'm not even sure if I planted it now I think about it. But, uh, if I did, then it should be there. Ah, I hadn't gotten that far yet. Makes sense. Okay, so... Gamma weed. There we go. Oop. I hit the wrong button. That was my bad. I can make four of them. Beautiful. Beautiful. Alright. Turn to the farmer. Are the gamma weed cuttings ready? They require delicate care in spite of their chaotic origins, or perhaps because of them. Who knows? Show me your successes. Technically, I have gamma root in hand, because I had a lot of it. So, yeah, we could hand it over. Finish this mission early. Ah, I will be able to make such fine dishes with this plant. It is a pity that you are unable to gorge on this radioactive treasure, Traveler. But perhaps I may offer an alternative. We will sate your hunger with beauty rather than food. Whoa. Hello. <laughs> we shall cultivate a crop of Gravitino hosts. I will be happy to tell you the history of this flora, should you wish it. My stories and theories seem to bore, other Gak friend. I suppose I am closest to the Corvax in my wish of study, but even then, those machines lack all sense of surprise, all passionate wonder. I must confess that I frequently feel lonely. What brought this on? Hireling Osu wishes for me to use the hydroponics tray to grow Gravitino hosts. I could do that. Many believe the Gravitino hosts cannot be cultivated through artificial means, but I know they are wrong, friend. You will reap the benefits of my experimentation. I guess I will. Although I'm not sure if I'll be doing it in this grow group here. I think I'll make another group of it over here. Yeah, sounds good to me. Uh, different set entirely. Right there. Whoops, helps if I don't rotate it for no reason. There we go. And I could build one more. And I will. Cool. This 
gravitina host he wanted me to do. It requires chromatic metal, silver, and magnetized ferrite. Interesting. All of those are so close at hand. Cool. All right. And when it comes to metal plates, I was pretty sure, and I was correct, that I was running low on that. There we go. And we deal with all of this. There we go. There's other bits that I was still holding on to. There we go. Put that there. And then throw that in here. Throw that in... Here, I guess. I don't remember where I put it. Oh, it was over here. Okay. Fair enough. And then put that in... Where does it go again? Huh. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Ta-da. I found it. Ta-da. Oh, man. I have a lot more salvage data than I thought. I'll need to fix that. For sure. And we'll just get that. Hmm. And put that there. Hmm. Put all these away too. I forgot. <laughs> I didn't do that yet. There we go. Perfect. Then I can just make a couple more of these. <laughs> well, maybe just one more because I don't have enough dirty bronze. But, uh, yeah, that works. And I need to give the Overseer the circuit board. That's right. I keep forgetting that. I trust our scientist was able to meet your needs, friend. They have the circuits we demand. As I approached the Overseer, I was almost certain I heard them talking to themselves spitting out words and phrases in a tongue I recognize but do not understand. But seconds later, there is no trace of the venom I thought I heard. I must be mistaken. Secretary McGain asks me for the circuit boards. Yep. The Overseer is strange, but no more so than any of the other beings I've encountered. Indeed, they have been more helpful than most. I hand over the circuits and receive my reward. Hey! A thing I already had. Ah, my friend, you will be so happy with Secretary McGain. I've drawn up plans for some starship technology, but I cannot yet sync my design with your ship. I shall need a gravitino ball to perfect my device. Overseer predicted I would be pleased, and once again they are correct. They have been ceaseless in their efforts to improve my lot. A gravitino ball is required to finish their promised starship technology. The farmer may be able to help acquire one. I currently am in the middle of that, right now. You will not regret it, friend. It is good we work together so well. I just need to wait for them to grow, and it takes about four hours, I think it said, so it's going to be, be a bit. But in the meantime, might as well gather what stuff I can. And maybe I can make more? Oh, I still don't have enough ammonia. Darn. Alrighty. Well, I can get rid of this now. Uh, -a there we go. And there we go. And yep, that was also a thing. And this is also a thing. Good. Good, 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 good. Alright. I was about to say, I'm not sure where I want to put this. I don't feel like here's a good idea. So, I think 
further down this way is a better idea. Just moving everything's going to be a pain. <laughs> there we go. Alright, and... Ta-da. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's good enough for me. Okay, so... That's all taken care of. That is growing. So, I guess... I just wait until that's done. Might as well collect the rewards from these. Debrief the commander... Activated copper, unrefined pyrite grease, dirty bronze. Okay, I could use that. Activated cadmium. There we are. A whole bunch of useful stuff. And not a lot of credits, but it's fine. I can live with that. Activated cadmium goes there. Good. And Dirty Bronze goes here, which means I can make at least two more of these before I almost run out of Lemium. Activated Copper goes there, and I think that means we're good. Yeah, I can sell that in that, but that'll be later. Brief the commander. Grantine. A lot of units. Activated Indium. Gek Relic. Albumen Pearl. Activated Cadmium. Corvax Convergence Cubes. Neural Duct. And a lot of credits. And one of these, I guess. Oh, this one's actually pretty old. <laughs> 2069. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Anyway. And... Whee! Blow through all of those. And... Let's see how many units. Not bad. Not bad. Not great. But not bad. Get relics there. Perfect. There's that taken care of. Grantine goes here. That's great. Uh, yep, this goes here. Ta-da. And this goes there. Ta-da. This goes over here. Ta-da. And yeah, I think that's it. Everything else I can sell. Ta-da. sell that for a profit of two million? Jesus! <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna get a lot from the pearls. Uh, bromide salts. All of it's produced locally. Oh. Man. Damn it. Alright, well. I know. Helps if I stop doing that. Um... I can make more of this, which is what I'll need. I need more tritium? Am I already starting to run low? Damn it, I am. God damn it. Okay, well, I guess I'll have to collect more later. But for now, let's check on what we can do. Marching into Sityas. It's a combat patrol. Not sure if I have enough combat ships for that. I do. I have a decent amount. I have a very decent amount. And it would overwhelm the difficulty of it anyway. So we're good. We're golden. 
Alrighty, and a balanced one. Okay. Yeah, that's good enough. <laughs> it exceeds the difficulty rating anyway. There we go. And how I if I hit the right buttons, that'd be fantastic. I'm not doing too bad. It's not that bad. It's not that bad at all. I was starting to worry that I wouldn't have enough for everything. It's, it's not that bad. Not that bad at all. Alright. So now it's time to get onto my ship. And possibly get some more ammonia. If any of my planets nearby have it. This one is uranium, because it's a nuclear planet, so you know. This one is an unknown planet. Another uranium one, but it's infested. What would infested mean? Infested by what? Paraffinium from the Xeno colony here. Huh. Interesting. guess none of that. No collecting of that. But maybe galaxy map. Orbital station coordinates received. Where's the next anomaly? It's a ways away. Not a major ways away. Oh, those were... Those are where my two fleets went. My two fleets that I sent out. Huh. So I could technically meet up with them. Oh. That's a way you can help continue the journey. If you're able to refine them nearby. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Okay. If they ended up damaged, you could just fly to where their ship is, or rather where their fleet is, and repair them from there, and then head back and make them continue. Interesting. That is an interesting notion. I'm hoping that's just not me thinking too far ahead <laughs> and thinking that that's how it works when it doesn't. Because, you know, I do that sometimes. Huh. Anyway. Yeah, the other two planets are the ones I scanned, and that's basically it. Hmm. It's unfortunate. <laughs> Only uranium, huh? Only uranium. Yeah, well. What I can do, I guess, is still fly over to that next system. Try and head to the Atlas. That's just out of jump range. Damn it. Oh. 
Apparently this fleet is in trouble just as I get in. Okay, well, I guess I should jump in and help them. I think I destroyed that ship in one shot. And destroyed that one in one shot. Jesus. I am just a killing machine. And all it's taking is rockets. Wow. Okay. I'll take it. These guys were not prepared for someone with rockets, I can So many ships to fight against. <laughs> well, hey, that's good. Your assistance will be rewarded. Organic life form. Blah, 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 please for reciprocal aid. Life form. Who must be the captain? Asks me aboard. Okay. Alert. Navigational data received. Oh! Oh, it's one of these. It's one of these. I have one of these. Actually, I have one of these in my own file. That I'm not progressing further than just exploring. <laughs> exploring, really, how the freighter system works. How the whole... Well, economy works, I guess. I have about six mil. Six million credits on that one. Actually, probably more now that I think about it. But, yeah, I'm really good. I'm really good at that. Whee! So, if I'm going to do anything... get all of this on my person. Whoop. Okay. If I am going to trade this in, this is going to be what I have to do. <laughs> That's depending on if this is good. Inspect the freighter. Yeah, the color's not great. But it does have a lot more slots. Sitting at 24 above 16. Color's meh, but I can always change that. I need 20 million units. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it would be so much better, but I need more money. <laughs> Damn. Uh, if only I could transfer money from my other account to this one. Oh, if only. Just 20 million and this could be mine. <laughs> and I wouldn't have to worry about the base because if I got it, the base would just transfer over as it's currently shaped. Mm. 
man. Why'd it have to be 20 million? 20 fucking million. Uh, at least I have a third of the head. scan this because I can't. Okay, this one has dioxide. And then this moon of it. This one has ammonia. Okay, that's good at least. Oh, hi there. More things I can't afford. Oh my goodness. Uh, 20 million Wowzers. Okay. Um. I want it. But I'm not sure if I can afford it before the opportunity is gone. So. It's gonna land. Also, I'm going to see what this is about. But first things first, I need to get rid of all of this. Because wowzers. I have a lot of stuff in my pockets. Right now. Because I figured I was going to be selling my own. <laughs> to do the exchange. I thought it was worth more than it was. That's not all my fault, but it is my fault a little. Uh, that, no, that's fine. That's that's fine where it is. Oh boy. That goes there. This goes there this goes there I guess <laughs> and that goes in there there we go okay what are you about purchase old scrap huh I'm not sure why I needed to see the scrap dealer but at least I know he's there. Well, hello. The mother of the sun. Hmm. The mother of the sun. Well, anyway. I can't get the ship I want. <laughs> I can get ammonia to make some more uh, fungal mold grow on my ship or in my base on my capital ship but the capital ship I want I can't afford so I guess I will wait until I can actually get it maybe a capped planet what does a capped planet mean I'm not sure what it'll mean but doesn't matter. <laughs> so I'm going to see if it's still on offer, I guess. Yeah, it probably will still be on offer. What am I kidding? I might as well bring my frigate over here because it'll be the money with that that will allow me to purchase this one. I just don't know if this one will be here by that time or not. 
So, for right now, I'm going to end today's episode. And, uh, start building up my supply of tritium, because I'm going to need a lot more of it for all of the expeditions we're going to have to do. Because I want more money so I can buy more of these things that are very good, very useful, and let's be honest, very cool. So, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together and I will see you all in the next episode. Been the one the only stray cat playing games and trying to well a explore a little bit but also b make a little money in the process because well i can't keep exploring without money unfortunately and uh more or less try to continue the game at the same time we know that the Atlas is asking us to help it because of some issue it's dealing with. The question is, what is that issue? And would we be actually enough of a help? That's an answer I don't have yet, but we will soon. For me, and for you!